Welcome back to The Talking Hedge. I'm Josh Kincaid, Capital Markets Analyst and host of your Cannabis Business Podcast. Back with us is Rohit Srivastav. He's the Chief Investment Officer and Portfolio Manager with C3 Fund to talk to us about his AI-based algorithm that has technical analysis with predictive analytics. There is also uh, a golden cross this last week in the market, which is a technical indicator. So historically, when that uh, 20 to uh, 50 to 200 day moving averages crosses over historically, that is a good sign for the market. We'll see, maybe it's too early since I think that just happened uh, today or yesterday. We'll see what happens with our, our AI robot, but first with the disclosures. But uh, Rohit, thanks for being back with us. Thanks, thanks Josh for having me. Uh, first a disclosure that this is all for entertainment. This is all learning. There's no financial advice given. Uh, please do your own analysis and invest on your own risk when you are doing, uh, when you're investing. We're not giving any financial advice here. So we have been talking about two types of indexes. One is the cannabis index, which is like a VIX, which tells how much, which way the market is going and how the stock is moving, how the cannabis in market overall is moving. There's two aspects of it, which is we have assigned a price and over uh, last couple of weeks, it has been hanging on to that 475 support. Uh, between 475 and uh, 535, it has been fluctuating on that, uh, which is a good sign that which is it's a holding. You can see that most of the time, that's where the stock has been holding off for a long period of time. So it's a good sign. And it's holding that resistance. From the cash in and outflow perspective, what we have been seeing is that there has been a huge buy-in starting uh, the early May until the end of June. There has been some sell-off here and there. and But the overall, considering the, the overall price and the cash, it looks like you know that it is ready for another jump up. But uh, when... We- Kind of, we're not sure, but I think it's it is at a good point where people want to get in. That might be that might be a good point to get in, like like we did. And I'll explain to you what we have been doing. Last time when we talked, it was uh, six twenty five, and we were not holding anything, and uh, we were we were anticipating that you know that there would be a downfall and there was slight downfalls around i think overall maybe five to ten percent of the whole cannabis market has fallen down in the last three to five weeks but if you look at this we now are holding six of them and we were temporarily holding cgc buying on 629 and 7 selling yesterday at 713 and what we are holding right now we are holding chronos Hexo and the other four as well. So from the overall gain perspective, where where we stand is we are basically now about 89% from the return from the August timeframe when we actually have started this podcast and this fund and we are about 60% this year itself. From last week perspective, if we compare to MJ and PodX, we are, uh, we're not holding a lot of stocks, but I think still our gains are about 3%. And that's probably one of the reasons why our gains are relatively higher because we're not holding a lot of stocks. But PodX and MJ, they have relatively huge losses as compared to compared to what, what we have. Summarizing, we basically have, uh, it's holding the 475 support and I think it's going to hold that support for some time. We're, we are into six of these equities, which looks like a high probability of going going up and we'll see that which one of them will basically pay us more on that and overall where our market is going is about 89 percent gains from the inception and 60 percent gains from year to year to date i mean some of these stocks if you look at some of them let's say chronos did a reasonably good gain on that but i think what it's holding up this line it has been holding up on this line and that's the 629 is this is the point where it was a buying point uh, of that and it has been holding off to that. I think the next stop of that is going to be this 200 day moving average. That's when our algorithm is going to sell it. But at this point, it looks like it is still, it is holding that. It's, it is not letting, it, it tried to fall down uh, one, two, three times, but it did not fell down. So it's holding that line and it's probably going to hit the 200 day moving average pretty soon in my view. So, uh, and I think that's the case with most of the, most of the stocks which we have. Hillary is probably trying to uh, correct again today. Most of the stocks are holding off to that line. And I think it corrected off today, but for this one, it's the 50 day moving average where it's basically yeah, 847. That's gonna be our selling point. When, if it reaches 847, that's will be when we'll be selling off. So those, those are just examples of how we are tracking them and what point are we buying and selling on that. 
So uh, just an example, uh, but that's where we are. We are about 60% gain year to date and 89% from the inception. That's all I have for you today. Those are pretty good examples looking at Tilray where 13 cents equates 1% for one day. So that's not too bad. You just take a little bit every day on Kronos. Uh, what was it? Um, 10 cents or something was six cents. Six cents was, was, yeah, it was 13% or, or a 2% for, for that day. Yeah. Um, so yeah, just small change for, for a decent amount. You just grab that every single day and add up and that's kind of how you, you get the, the returns that we've, we've had. So Looking forward to next week. Uh, looks like some technicals might be interesting. We've hit some bottom lows. Expect that to rebound. Um, all good indicators for, for another uh, profitable week. So looking forward to seeing if that comes to fruition next week. All right, with that, we're going to roll this one up. I want to thank my guest, Rohit Trivastov, Chief Investment Officer and Portfolio Manager with C3 Fund. Rohit, thanks for being back on the podcast. Thanks. Thanks for having me, Josh. I'm Josh Kincaid. This is The Talking Hedge. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, or don't, and I'm out. Don't forget to smash that like button on your way out and check out these other videos that we've got.